Hello friends. In this video, I will talk about how to install True TrueCrypt, an encryption tool on Linux Mint, and how to encrypt your files using that. So, to install, open the internet browser and go to truecrypt.org website and just click here on downloads move to the Linux uh, section here select a package standard 32 bit and just just download this star.gg file so just save this So it is now downloaded. I am going to close this browser and let's move to the download folder. This is the tar.gg file that I just downloaded. So you have to right click here and extract it here. It is now extracted and this is the uh, auto executable file here so just uh, double click here and run this here you can see uh, two options here install true crypt and extract so just uh, enter option one here enter so press enter again to display the license terms just uh, continue pressing space bar to go to the end next uh, here you can see line do you accept agree to be bound by the license terms just uh, type here yes and enter now it should start installing package but first you have to give your password just enter your password here and enter so it is now installed I have to press enter to exit next uh, let's launch the TrueCrypt I'm going to search it here TrueCrypt so this is the interface and for the first time you have to create a volume that volume will will be similar to a hard disk drive so just create here volume and just uh, select here create an encrypted file container move next standard true crypt volume already selected again move next so here you have to uh, select the volume location for that uh, it should be any file so uh, that file will, will be same but actually uh, it will be a volume so just click here select file and uh, I am I'm going to select uh, one file my notes that is in my documents selected and just save here so uh, you can give a new name here otherwise uh, this file will be lost In, anyway next uh, after that volume location uh, next 
this is the encryption algorithm uh, AES that means uh, advanced uh, uh, advanced encryption standard and uh, there are other, there are other encryption algorithm also of different level but uh, for this uh, video I am selecting this AES and just everything just leave everything here same next next uh, I have this much uh, 16 gigabyte of uh, free space available for this volume size so uh, for this uh, video I am taking this very small size up to 10 MB that would be enough so you can just give uh, whatever you want here next next here you have to give any password but uh, before that you should know that passwords would be very strong so that no one can just uh, access that uh, but uh, for this demo I am giving this a very short password or you can uh, there, there is other option also you can use key files so suppose uh, if anyone uh, if anyone knows your password still he can't access uh, access your data without any key files so you can just uh, select this option also if you want but uh, you don't have to lose that key file because that is very important file so anyway um, I, I'm leaving this option here after that next so I'm getting this warning message that short passwords are easy to crack using brute force technique so I know that uh, for this demo it is short anyway uh, next yes and so t this will create new volumes and I have to format it uh, so file system type as fat next next you have to just move your mouse so that this encryption process uh, is fast anyway now format so are you, you want to delete the file yes the true crit volume has uh, been successfully created okay and exit next uh, you can just uh, mount that uh, new volume here so just select file you have to select the file here my notes you can see on the 10.5 MB size here open and just uh, just click on mount Okay, um, just select here one and mount. Next, uh, this is the slot you have to select here. Next, you have to give the password. Mm, password. Just enter that password. Okay. Again, you have to give the the user password or root password. okay now it is mounted and you can see here the the 10 MB of volume with uh, with label true crypt is here there is nothing inside you can keep a uh, important file here to encrypt so that's all for now friend I hope this video was helpful for you thank you for watching